Hi, I'm Fate Touched, and this is me playing games. And we are back to Prime Suspects Mystery Case Files number two. And she's Hot Punk. And I will put the disclaimer at the beginning again. This is a game from 2005, and it is not full screen, and it is stupid tiny. It takes up one fifth of my monitor, the actual gameplay area. So I have to actually pull my monitor so it's only like eight inches away from my face. Yeah, weird, right? <laughs> so I might click off often and I might have a hard time seeing things because it's gonna be really tiny. Yes, that was a long time ago. It was, it was. All right, so let's get back to where we were. So we have done, what number are we on? We're on level 12. So we've done 11 bad guys and we have found two prime suspects. We need three more. So let's get to it. Level 12, Ronnie Tidwell, AKA Big Iron Ronnie. Occupation, street performer. Prior arrests, assault and battery charges after biting an opponent's thumb off during a match. This former professional wrestler was forced to complete a court-ordered anger management course. There he discovered inner peace and his fondness for pantomime. Suspect reserves the right to remain silent. This is so lame. <laughs> Explore places the suspect frequents and see if you can gather enough clues to figure out where he was the night the diamond was stolen from the Piazza Gallery. Yeah, uh, we're trying to find a diamond thief. I forgot about that part. All right, let's start investigating. We have 42 minutes to complete this section. Oh, I've only been playing for three hours. That's not bad, okay. Okay, where do we want to go? I think we've been to all of these already, so let's just start over here. Right, let's see. So we need an ancient scroll, a plea, a plea? Peanut shears, a deadly sin. Funnel, porthole, and microphone. This, this, so this is a second Mystery Case Files game. The first one was basically the same, but older. This one actually has like some odd things you're supposed to look for. It has some different mini games. So I, I guess a plea is probably written words or something. I don't know. All right, well, we need ancient scrolls. Let's find that first. Ah, yes. I seem to remember that from last time. Okay, so ancient scrolls, a plea, and a peanut. Anybody want a peanut? Red rum is not a plea. Greed is a deadly sin, though. Red handprint? No. What am I looking for? Ancient scrolls. I'm actually looking for... Ha ah, Look at this! 8675309. <laughs> That's cute. Oh! A plea! Help! The sheep is stuck. I did not see any ancient scrolls, though. A peanut. A peanut. There's a brain. Porthole is the green window. This. Yes. You're correct. Shears and a funnel. I thought I saw a funnel. I don't know where it was, but I thought I saw it. Up oh, there it is. I was right. And shears and a peanut. There's the peanut. The mousey has it. And, uh, ancient scrolls. I'm surprised I haven't seen that one yet. Probably because it's where I'm not looking. Ah, there's the shears where I wasn't looking. This game tricks you into th into ignoring part of the scene as background, but nothing in the scene is background. It's all foreground. It's all stuff that could be stuffed somewhere. Oh wait. When we get to one, I can go to the map and do a different one. I knew that. Oh, we have, have we been here? I don't think we've been here. All right, goggles, sword, typewriter, cannon, sea urchin recorder, snail shell, tape measure. And the seashell, no. Yeah, I think this one is new too. Oh, goggles. And a sword. I, I got back into playing Animal Crossing because I have a problem and there was something at Nook's store yesterday. It was like a 
a two-handed sword or a two-edged sword or something like that, it was 150,000 bells left. No, wait. Tape measure is upper left. Yes! Yeah, 150,000! I'm like, whoa, that is really cool, but that is a lot of money! Holy crow! But yeah, I might be re-addicted to Animal Crossing again. Are they going to be coming out with another one next year? Because that's usually how they operate. They get you addicted to one, you get bored, and then they put out another one. Cannon and a sea urchin shell. I'm like not doing good tonight. All right, a sword and a typewriter. One of those should be easy to find. And a bat, and a lizard, and another lizard. And no fishing off pier. There's a little goblin dude. There's an urchin. All right, sword, typewriter, cannon. Oh, there's a sword. It looked weird because it it's wrapped. Peace, peace wrapping. Another lizard. There are lots of lizards in this level. Lizards in the level. Oh, there's cannon. Yeah, it is on my. I think it's because it's dark. Like there's the one bright spot, but then everything else is kind of dimly lit. And that is really making it hard to see stuff. I keep thinking this is the typewriter, but it is not. Okay, typewriter, recorder, snail shell. The recorder has to be straight up and down, I assume. As long as it's talking like a flute recorder. Oh, that's the typewriter! That's cheating, only part of it was showing. And the snail shell. I have not been looking for the snail shell. The recorder, the recorder should be- Oh, there it is, I was right. That was very well disguised as a pipe. Next. Auto salvage. We have definitely been here before. Staff, snake. That's the staff. Yes? No? Okay. There's snake. <clears throat> Orange. Sorry, possum. Three crescent moons. Pliers, three saucers, and two balloons. Okay. Well, there's one balloon. And there's a crescent moon. Alright, staff, three crescent moons. Oh, there's another one. What do you mean by staff? Hmm. Uh, one crescent moon and two crows. There's a crow, and there's a crow. And pliers. There's pliers. Three saucers. Oh, there's a flying saucer. I bet the other ones are like cup saucers. This? Yep. Wait, I thought I saw another one. Maybe not. And another balloon. There's a balloon. Okay, staff, crescent moon, and saucer. Staff, crescent moon, and saucer. I wonder how long it takes to make one of these levels. I bet it's fun. It certainly looks fun to me. Right, okay. I did not do a good job of looking for things. That's a broom. That's a horn of some sort. Those are the fence poles. There's a spear. Crescent moon. Crescent moon is probably like an, an image on something. Like there's an eyeball, that kind of thing. Yeah, this one's hard. And it wasn't that hard last time. They're getting harder. In the first game, they were kind of all the same level of difficulty, except one or two levels were like, I have no idea where anything is. But most of them, it was kind of easy. We're getting dumber. That is also possible. I know it's been a long day over in this area of the world. We got snow and I had to shovel the driveway. And I really like shoveling the driveway, but it was in the teens and my nose got cold real fast. But also, like... I am so out of shape that I came in and like my body was like, what did you do? I am not seeing anything. Let's use one hint. Oh, that is cheating and I never would have find it, found it. As a music staff. Sheesh. Not okay, game. They're getting tricky. Alright, I know there's two left, but we're gonna go to another level. Millie the Milliner. Lime slices, bacon, peanuts, triangle, pizza, baseball gloves, scorpion, and rooster. 
a lime slices, and bacon. Bacon sounds good. I had French toast for dinner. My hubby made me French toast and it's delicious. And now I have a happy tummy, but I really want rock cookies. And I don't know if I want to make them or not. Rock cookies are also delicious. They are basically no-bake peanut butter chocolate fudge with oats in them. They're not actually cookies. And it takes like 10 minutes to make them. And they are so good. I'll include the recipe in the description. Matter of fact, if you ever look at my games on YouTube, the recipes, or the recipes, the stuff we talk about, which is sometimes recipes, is all in the description, regardless of what weirdness we are talking about at the time. I am just like wandering around here. All right, peanuts triangle, scorpion rooster. Peanuts, okay, maybe it's like a bag of peanuts. Rooster is lower left side. There's a snowman. Oh, there he is, I see him. All right, yeah, I got him. Peanuts triangle scorpion. Wait, is that a triangle? That's a triangle too. I don't think that's what it means. I think it means like a musical triangle. Peanuts and a scorpion. Scorpion should be pretty easy to find too, you would think. They have a very distinctive shape. Oh look, it's one of those snakes with the um with the segmented things and you hold onto the tail and if you move your hand a little bit, he slithers back and forth. Those are fun. I haven't thought about those in a long time. I am looking for a scorpion. There's a bat and a raccoon. That kind of looks like Cthulhu. I'm not sure what that's supposed to be. Where are the peanuts? Oh, I found them. That's cute. All right, and a triangle. One would think would also be easy to find because it's shaped like a triangle. But in the last one, they hid part of the stuff behind things. So maybe it's not easy to see. Triangle and a scorpion. I'm surprised I didn't find the scorpion yet. There's a key cat. And a seahorse. Oh, there he is. Yep. That's very well done. Okay, next place. Rooftop. Parrot, typewriter, chest, trout. Two, twelve. Pig, rock car, and cigarette. There's the pig. I remember that from one of the other episodes. Episodes. One of the other uh, playthroughs. Is a flying pig. And there's the parrot. And I thought I saw the typewriter just now, but I might just have typewriters on my brain now. Chest. There's a chest. And a trout. No, that's not it. And a rocket car. That's interesting. Uh, let's see. There's a roller skate. Oh, there it is. Right below the green roof is the mid- Oh, they did it sideways again. I don't know why that's a thing, but apparently it's messing me up good. Trout is a fishy. Where's the- Oh, there he is. 212 should be easy enough to find. Ha ha ha. Now I'm all, like, suspicious because they did that stupid thing with the- Oh, there it is. Wow, that's tiny. Oh my gosh. All right, and, oh, we can go to the next one. Oh, we're totally all uh, quarantined because my sister's family got COVID too. We just got tested yesterday. So that's a fun thing that's going on over here too. None of us are sick, but it's a good idea to get tested. One of my kids got the rapid test, but they were only had one left. So the rest of us had to do the long ones. Yeah. So he is negative but we won't get our test results back till tomorrow or Monday. So, we shall see. I don't think we have it, but anybody's guess these days, right? Oh, and we're all vaccinated. So, actually my sister's family was all vaccinated too. This is the stupid Omicron thing. Hook up or left. Yes, I went right past it. Map. Lynn's Pub. Eight ball, musical note, golf ball, rubber ducky, hand, Chinese lantern, shield, soda spritzer. Soda spritzer. I kind of wish those things were still a thing because in cartoons they look like fun to spray people with, but they're not really a thing anymore. 
At least I don't think they are. Eight ball, music note, golf ball. I just saw one of those things. Musical note. There's a musical note. An elephant. I don't need an elephant. I need a rubber ducky though. There he is. And a hand, which I did see. And a Chinese lantern, which is over here. Remember that from last time. And a shield, which is over here. Okay. It's a pear tree. <laughs> That's amazing. Yay, we finished one. Yeah, telling stories is a family, I don't know if I would say gift. Ability? <laughs> That's awesome. What story? You don't have to retell it. Let's see, artist brush, fry pan, and cantaloupe. Oh, there's cantaloupe. Actually, that looks like a musk melon. It's slightly different. Or we have the musk melons and the cantaloupes are the ones that look like that. I forget, there's a weird thing with cantaloupes and musk melons. One of them we can't get here. Yes! Yes! Yeah, I know that story. Botpunk has good stories. She writes some of them down and sells them. I'll put a link in the description. What am I looking for? Three arrows, flower, gun, artist, brush. Where's the flowers? And a butterfly. Sometimes you write them down or sometimes they're good. Because I think most of your stories are good. There's a yarn ball. What am I doing? <laughs> Yes, to which part? <laughs> oh, there's the flowers. I love the elephant in the car. I wonder how they got him in there. Up, oh, found the gun. I knew it. I remembered it being here. And three arrows. I don't think I've seen any arrows. Yeah, I have. I saw this one. Where are the other arrows? Oh, there's the artist brush. Good. Yeah, one of the reasons I decided to do this is I talk to myself when I'm playing these games anyway. So I figure I might as well record it. And now that I'm doing it and I'm talking on purpose, I can talk even more, which some people I know would think would be impossible. Talking. Uh, here, what are we looking for here? A snail shell. Up oh, there it is. I was thinking of a spirally one, like round, but that's a sea, sail, sea snail shell, which is different. Triangle. Yep, the pokey one. Candy corn. I can't have any more candy corn until October. I'm only allowed to eat seasonal treats in the month that they happen, because if I don't, there's the triangle. That's evil. And that's actually a square, not a triangle, even though it's triangle shaped. I, 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 if I was allowed to eat all of the uh, different yummy foods that exist in in the universe, like Cadbury eggs, for example, or candy corn, or that kind of stuff, then I would probably die from eating too much junk. So I set a rule that I'm only allowed to eat seasonal candy in the month of their holiday. Irish potatoes, that's another one. That's a tri-state area candy, I think. I don't know if they have that anywhere else. It's basically coconut cream rolled in cinnamon. And it's amazing. And Ot Punk doesn't like them because she hates coconuts. Which is a shame. There's the arrow. Yes, I know. Which is a shame because it's really good. Especially if you get soft, fresh ones. Oh my gosh. There's a candy factory near us, which is, first of all, amazing. And uh, they make fresh ones in March, and it's like, it probably should be illegal. Oh, I can use a hint. Oh, that's cheating. I was looking for a straight arrow. <laughs> Shredded coconut is grass. Well, the, the, um, oh, hell no. Hang on a moment. I have to call someone. See if he answers his phone. Yes. Hi, you're streaming on the internet. And so am I. A and we came into one of those word scramble things and I need your help. <laughs> I, I'm not streaming on the internet. I well, no, no, you currently are. I have you on speakerphone by the microphone. Oh, so people can hear me is what you're saying. Yeah, you, you are literally streaming on the internet right now. 
Hi, Internet. <laughs> can, can you come and help with the word scramble, please? Yes, I can come over to the word scramble. Thank you. Love you. Bye. Okay, reinforcements. Tiller. What? I didn't even look to see. Yep, there it is. I didn't even look to see what it is. Gardening tools. Okay. Track? Okay, no. Ten. <laughs> I'm dyslexic, in case this is your first episode of this. And I am... There, my brain is not happy with any of this nonsense. So, wait, ooh, I found shovel. <gasps> Yay! So, my loving husband, Rug Erdite, is a more word person. Pruner! See, there he is. Where? Top row backwards. Oh, wow, I never would have gotten that. That doesn't even look like a word. Starting next to the K. Yeah, no, I got it, I got it. Thank you. XX. I'm trying to think of words, even. Trimmer middle. Oh, wow, look at that. How about a hoe? A hoe would be one, right? H-O-E. We're tilling with. Aha! Aha, ha, ha. There we go. That was an easy one. Ha, 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 ha. Far left column. Was that the one you were I found? Yeah. So we found shovel, pruner, hoe, tiller, trimmer. What else? All the letters are making me uncomfortable. <laughs> if if all the letters were weird like this, but like, let's, let me see if I can find an example. I'm not gonna be able to find an example. Oh, maybe they are in this one. One of the other ones, like there were different A's and B's. This one, like all the R's are the same. That makes it a little bit easier, but apparently not a lot bit easier. A trowel. Wow, this one's a lot harder than the other one. Uns, more than one. So, sack. You can't go suck. You can't do diagonal, right? Axe. Really? That's one of them? Axe? Oh, and it's right here. No, it's not. No, it's A-X-E, maybe? I bet that is one. Where's another X? I don't think there are anymore. What about, like, shears? Since this game loves to do shears so often. Track? No, I found that one first. Shears would be one. Bottom row, right side. Yeah, no, okay, I got it. Fesh? <laughs> wagon! I know, right? Where, where is there a wagon? Wagon. Wagon down the middle. Wagon! Yep, you're right. I would say wheelbarrow, but I don't see any double E's anywhere. Right. Mower? Mower! Yay! See, I told you he was good at these. Innocent! Well done, Agent. So it seems Mr. Tidwell was not involved with the diamond heist after all. Several passers-by corroborate his alibi by placing him in front of the hat store at the time of the crime. Please look elsewhere for a prime suspect. Okay. Yeah, well, we'll do that if you finish. There we go. All right. Th thank you, Erdite. I'm very bad at that. Not my strong suit. All right. Level 13, John Thomas, Johnny Vicious. Occupation soccer hooligan. <laughs> Prior arrest, did porridge for filching and flogging? Blimey, this dodgy bloke likes to get bloody, well sozzled, and toss a keen wobbly he does. Why, you'd be off your trolley to slag this cheeky old sod. What? I am going to guess that is not correct slang. But we're going to keep going. This spastic sportsman likes to hang around the pub, so be sure to stop by and search for some clues. When you find enough evidence, use the crime computer to unravel the mystery of where the suspect was when the diamond theft took place. Is he a prime suspect? Oh wow, we only get 33 minutes for this one. All right, let's see. Okay, let's try the city dump first. Oh, right, I forgot about the battery thing. Okay, let's go over here. Oak tree, which we couldn't find the first time. Three butterflies. There's one. A mouse, which I remember seeing and now I don't see it. Pencils. A snake. Strawberries. 
And a necktie. Oh, and spectacles. There's his spectacles. Mouse. Oh, he's so cute. He's trying to steal the sausage. Oh, I know where the snake is. Snake. Pencils. Multiple pencils. A necktie and two butterflies. All right, let's see. Where's the butterflies? There's a bat. Butterfly and pencils. Firefly. And garlic. Oh, there's another butterfly. And pencils and a necktie. Oh, I wasn't looking for the necktie. But I also don't see the pencils. Where's the necktie? In a normal game, it would probably be around someone's neck. Necktie on the chair. Oh, you're right. Yep. Yeah, I'm not sure. Oh, you're right. I think that is like a bench in front of the store. The Aristocrat Hotel. Oh, I need another battery. Heck, not it. Flynn's Pub. Rubber Ducky is up here. Milk Bone. Yeah. Spider. I know there's a spider in here. I remember seeing it. But I don't see it now. Cat is also in here. But I don't know where that is. Roman Helmet. Crossbow Golf Club Paintbrush. Little Alligator. And there's a snake. And a dragon. Alright. Milk bone, spider, cat. Spider cat! There's a cat. Okay. Milk bone, spider, Roman helmet. Milk bone. Oh, there's a crossbow. Milk bone, spider, Roman helmet. And a butterfly. There's a spider. You want a cat with eight legs? Why? You're a weird person. More cats and pets. Spider cats. Oh, I see. I, I missed that. I thought you were just being weird. Oh, last thing. Which, oh wait, there wasn't a, uh, I didn't want, was there a battery in here anywhere? No. They're usually pretty easy to see if you're actually paying attention. There's battery, see? All right. Scythe. Protractor, which is right there. Dragonfly, soda bottle, dinner plate, which is right there because I couldn't find it first time. Tennis ball, necklace, infinity. Right, a scythe, a dragonfly, and a soda bottle. Scythe, a dragonfly, and a soda bottle. Up oh, there's dragonfly. Where's the scythe? That'd be kind of hard to hide, you would think. There's a spear. Is that it? No, that's a horn. Ah, uh, let's see. And a tennis ball. I've never seen a tennis ball. There's a tennis ball. And infinity's got to be, like, on something with signs. Up oh, there it is. It looked like an eight. All right. Scythe, soda bottle, necktie. Scythe. Nope, that's a golf club. There's a champagne bottle, and a shell, and a ghost lady, and more butterflies, and a hot dog, and more hot dogs. So Brett's hot dogs are really good, which I think is what I figured out this is supposed to look like. But I actually don't remember now. That might have been a different game. Soda bottle next to the flowers. Oh, I thought that was another champagne bottle. <laughs> Scythe and necktie. They usually do really well at hiding the neckties. I'm not entirely sure why that is. I'm surprised I can't find the scythe though. There's an Illuminati pyramid. What else is here? I don't know what that is, but it's, there is a pumpkin. And a plane. And another plane. And a hawk. And I am not looking, am I? There's a spider. Where is it? Unless they shrunk it down real small. It's gotta be... Is this it? No. Huh. Oh? Oh, what? Oh, I'm looking for necktie and it's necklace. Yeah, I'm an idiot. Dyslexia, my favorite thing. The conservatory. Ooh, fancy. Telescope, apple, two hearts, starry eye, which is that, fortune cookie, glass eye, watch, and red shoe. There's a red shoe. Right, telescope, apple, and two hearts. 
telescope. There's an apple. Apple, 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 apple. Fortune cookie. Fortune cookie. Two hearts, a glass eye, and a watch. So a watch and two hearts. There's one heart. Watch. There's a pocket watch. Oh, okay, that's what they want. I was thinking of the other kind of watch. And now we just need a heart. There's a club. Is that a heart? Oh yeah, anatomical heart. Cute. Up, oh, see dump. Oh right, I forgot. Okay, skull scissors, dime fountain pen, blue marble, soccer ball, two lizards. Alright, so skull scissors dime. These are incredibly difficult. Here's the blue marble. Can you see a lizard? No. Uh, skull scissors dime. So there's lots of keys in here. Is that a pen? No, it's a spoon handle. There's a pen. Skull, scissors, dime. Ooh, onion rings. Those look good. There is a lot of food in these games. There's an eye. <laughs> Alright, what am I doing? Skull, scissors, dime. Not eye. He's a lizard. I don't know what kind he is. He's a cool lizard. Skull, scissors, dime. I still have not found any of those. 25 cents, but dimes are 10 cents, so that doesn't... There's another lizard. Oh, I needed two lizards. I thought I only needed one. I was not paying attention. I need a frog. And TNT. A domino. What am I looking for? Skull, scissors, dime. I think I saw the scissors already. And I totally wasn't paying attention. I seem to think I did. So, scissors, dime, soccer player. I saw him too. Nope, that's a cowboy. <clears throat> There's a bowl of cereal. Fruit Loops, specifically. There's a cow. Scissors! I did see them. Good job, me. And a dime, and a soccer ball. Soccer ball. And a ladybug. And a lobster. A cooked lobster. That also looks delicious. Right, dime was in the very first picture. Wow. Excellent. Okay, skull. I have not seen a skull. A skull, soccer ball, and a ladybug. There's a firefly. Let's go this way now. Skull, soccer ball, ladybug. Skull, there it is, I saw that twice. A ladybug, no. Soccer ball, I saw that once. And ladybug, we're just gonna get this level done if I can find it in this round. That's a tick. Really, that's supposed to be a ladybug? That looks like a tick. Ugh, all right. Uh, back over here. Pencils. Multiple pencils. Wash me. I don't see any pencils. Hmm. I'll get a hint. Oh, wow. I never would have found that. I mean, it kind of looks like pencils, but it also kind of looked like bamboo. Alright, let's see. Uh, oh, we have to do this one too. Okay, let's see. Arrowhead ruler, dartboard, oil can, thread, two apples, two keys, and two shells. So, arrowhead ruler and a dartboard. Arrowhead. Gotcha. Ruler, dartboard, oil can. Ruler, dart. Do I need a shell? Yes. Ruler. Oh, there's two shells. Dartboard, oil can. There's a lobster. Is that the oil can? Yes. Ruler, dartboard, thread. Didn't I see thread? Maybe not. Ruler, dartboard, thread. Ruler, dartboard, thread. I'm not just saying that to fill the silence, by the way. If I don't repeat it, I will forget what I'm looking for. Ruler, thread, two apples. ADHD is fun, by the way. Oh man, I think I saw two keys, too. See what I mean? Ruler, thread, two apples. Is that an apple? No, okay. Let's start over here and go up and down. Ruler, thread, oh, there's an apple. Two apples and two keys. Is that a key? No, that's part of the bell. There's a key. See? So ruler, thread, apple, key. Ruler, thread, apple, key. Ruler. Why am I not seeing the ruler? Ruler, thread, apple, key. 
Hmm. There's his thread. I did see it. And that's not an apple there, huh? I don't know what that actually is. Rocky. Alright, let's go this way. Ruler. Apple. Yeah. There's the apple. I passed that like eight times. Ruler and a key. There's keys here, is that what you mean? Excuse me. I don't see the ruler. I mean, there's only so many places you can hide a ruler. Oh, there's a drawer. Hmm. That's not a ruler, and that's not a ruler. Not, it's not on the floor somewhere, is it? That's not it. That looks like a ruler. I actually have a black ruler with white letters, and I have no idea why they thought that was a good idea. Alright, let's uh, move on. Right, okay, back to the hotel. Oh, that's where we just were. Gosh darn it. That's back to the pub. Golf club. Where's the golf club? There it is, right in front of me. Up. And now we're back over here with the scythe. Hmm. It's some place that I have not looked yet. Yeah, I agree. Do you see anything there? Oh, shush. I don't see anything. There's nothing there. If we find everything else, I'm coming back to use a hint to see where it is again. Oh, uh, we have to go over here. Oh, we only need one more. All right, if we only need one more. I'm totally using a hint again. I see it. There it is. Yeah, I kind of agree with that. Ah, the traditional puzzle puzzle. Alright. Uh-oh, this guy looks like he's suspicious. Maybe he is the one who stole the diamond. Or, yeah, that's what we're looking for. The person who stole the diamond. Uh, I don't know where you think you're standing. Ah, okay, now I've got part of him. Why does he have a giant question mark on him? Does that mean he's a suspect? Or just suspicious? I mean, he's a suspect, but I mean, does that mean he's guilty? They're technically all suspects, aren't they? Uh, this has a lot of things that look exactly the same in it. Alright. that. That's over here. Over here somewhere. Over there. Oh, that goes in the corner, that goes there. Ta-da! Commendable clue catching, Agent Fate. The bartender at the suspect's usual watering hole was unable to authenticate his presence the night of the gem theft. <gasps> this singular fact enforces his suspicion as the prime as a prime suspect. Click below to begin analyzing another clue. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Level 14. Vincent Gavani. Vinny the Chin. Occupation. Token Mafia Guy. Money laundering exor exhortation. Extortion. Loan sharking, etc. As long as it's criminal in nature, former Stain member, that was the bad guy organization from the first game, and mafioso Gavani has probably been involved. <laughs> Mafia stuff. Suspect was last seen purchasing ravioli flavored. A ravioli flavored pinky ring? All his favorite stories end with So then I whacked the stinking mom. <laughs> I should probably, as a Italian American, be offended by that, but <laughs> that's so dumb. Take a look around the city for clues, and then use the crime computer to decipher where the thug was when the diamond heist occurred. And we have 38 minutes. Ooh, a new place. A carousel. That is very weird. Alright, so we need a carrot, a whisk broom, a toy kangaroo. Why are we specifying it's a toy? A star ornament, two swords, grapes, a femur, and an electrical outlet. Okay. Carrot, toy kangaroo, and a star ornament. The carnival barker is annoying me. He's very in the background if you have low volume. 
I don't know why he's annoying me, but he is. Carrot, two swords, grapes, and a femur. I thought I saw grapes. Is that grapes? Yep. A femur. Up oh, there it is. And an electrical outlet. Two swords and a carrot. Two swords. There's one sword. One sword and a carrot. Carrot, carrot, carrot. Carrot, carrot, and oh, I wasn't looking for swords either. It's like my mind can only hold one thing at a time. It's kind of annoying. Up oh, there's that same wrapped sword again. All right, next, the Tunnel of Terror. We did do this one as a puzzle, and it took forever because everything in the puzzle looks exactly the same. All right, let's see. Uh, Ninja Star, a flask. The sun, which I know I just saw. There it is. Manacles, chainsaw, dagger, a ribcage, and a pair of dice. Okay. Manacles, chainsaw, dagger, and dice. Manacles, chainsaw, dagger, and dice. Dice. Yep, I found them. <laughs> Manacles. Oh boy. Hello, what can I do for you? Why are you looking at me like that? I didn't do nothing. What do you want? I don't have any keys. Wait, wait, wait. Amber wants a joke. Who's there? He says, who's there? <laughs> Two. Two. Two who? Two who? Close my door. He just Hi, walked Amber. away. <laughs> he just walked away. Also, wait, also that I know. We already went over that. He just walked away. And then he comes back and he says, Tell Amber to be quiet. <laughs> Apparently, he doesn't like grammar jokes. Rocco's News. That's your favorite knock knock joke, really? Spark plug clown. Clown. Rose key ladybug. Two garden trowels. There's one. A saw and a horseshoe. There's a saw. Okay. Spark plug, rose, and key. Spark plug. Is that a rose? No, that's a rose. Rose. Okay. Key, trowel, and a horseshoe. Horseshoe, key, and a trowel. Up oh, there it is. That's a shovel. That's like a sand shovel. Do I see the key anywhere before we go? Nope. All right. Curiosity shop. Oh yeah, this place is bizarre. Gold key. Two frogs. Red totem. Just like this. Oh, like a totem pole. Okay. Two combs. Three butterflies. The seventh letter? Oh, you can make me figure that out. Two citrus <laughs> and a glass eye. All right, what's the seventh letter? A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Thank you. So gold key, frogs, and combs. Let's do that first. There's a frog. No, you're right. There it is. G. Can anybody, like, go to a letter in the alphabet and know what comes next without singing the stupid song? Is that just a me thing? Because I can't think of anything unless I am singing the song. If they're a robot. <laughs> Gold key, one frog, two combs. Two combs. Is that a- well, that's like the one ring there. And comb. There's a comb. Ah, oh, there's the gold key. And a pterodactyl. And a butterfly. And another butterfly. And a frog, a comb, and a citrus fruit. Okay. I thought I saw another citrus fruit, but maybe not. Frog. Oh, there it is. It's grapefruit. And I did see it. One frog, one comb. Froggy, froggy, froggy. Mr. Froggy, where are you? There's a fishy. And a chipmunk. And whatever he is, an alien. Oh, there he is. There's a frog. Alright. Next. A playhouse. Two triangles, a bluebird, a bunny, 
a fleur-de-lis, a rocket, a pipe wrench, two spades, there's one, and a domino. Okay, two triangles, a bunny, and a fleur-de-lis. There's the domino. Two triangles, there's one. Bunny and a fleur-de-lis. There's the fleur-de-lis. A triangle, a bunny, and a rocket. Oh, there's the bunny. I went right past it. Good job. A triangle, a rocket, and a pipe wrench. Triangle, a rocket. That's cool. And a pipe wrench. Hmm, that's a triangle. I mean, it's also a spear. Oh, there's the rocket. I actually think that's a bomb, but sure, that works. That's a caliper, that is not a pipe wrench. All right, a spade and a triangle. Those are all hearts. And another heart. Not looking for hearts. Spade and a triangle. It took me a minute to figure out that this was an actual picture of something and not just weird shapes on a purple background. Good job, me. There's a comb. <laughs> that was the last one. Music note. What am I looking for? A triangle and a spade. And a nose. There's a triangle. I went right past that, too. Produce stand. It's a frog. Do I need a frog? I need a frog. Okay. Two lizards. A fire alarm. A stapler, which is up here. I remember that from last time. A slingshot. An old football helmet. A toy boat and a feather. Say toy boat five times fast. Can't do it. It's toy boat, toy boat, toy boat. Toy boat, toy boat, toy... Yeah, I can't even do it a couple times. That's one of those uh, tongue twisters. Toy boat... That's right. I can only do one good tongue twister. And that's a B one. Hang on, I need a drink first. Alright, here we go. Ready? Betty bought her, bought some butter, but she said the butter's bitter. If I put it in my batter, it'll make my batter bitter. So she put some better butter, that better than her bitter butter. Put it in her batter, and her batter was not bitter. So this is better Betty bought her, bought a bit of better butter. Ta-da! That's the only tongue twister I can do. That's not a lizard. You can barely talk. <laughs> thank you, thank you. I'm here all night. The sewer. Oh, this one was silly. There's the rhinoceros in the sewer. <laughs> All right, what are we doing? Handcuffs, calipers, which I just saw in the last one. Duck with a knife. That's weird. Someone flushed a baby rhino. I don't know, is that a baby one? He looks pretty big. All right, <laughs> I just saw the hook. I'm not paying attention. A pickaxe, uh, which is that. A bear claw? Is that what that's supposed to be? That looks like a cryptid of some sort. A fountain pen. Where's the frog? There's a frog. And bug spray, which I remember finding last time. Yep. It's fine. <laughs> All right, where's the calipers? Caliper, caliper, caliper. There's that bomb again that they think is a rocket. Not a rocket. I don't... Oh. That's a different kind of caliper. Okay. Oh, we have this one. All right. Caterpillar television, which I see every time I'm in this level and now I don't know where it is. Fine, be that way. Oh no, there it is. Television teeth, pretzel, sickle, staff. Still not that, right? Two hearts and two handprints. Okay. Caliper, no. That was the last level. Caterpillar. Teeth and pretzel. Caterpillar teeth and jellyfish. Caterpillar teeth and pretzel. Caterpillar teeth and sickle. That's down here. Caterpillar teeth and staff, which we weren't able to find last time. Ah, uh, there's one heart. Caterpillar teeth, heart, and handprint. There's a handprint. There's a teeth. Caterpillar, teeth, heart, and handprint. There's the other handprint. Where's the other heart? Caterpillar, staff, and heart. Okay, where's the caterpillar? There he is. Caterpillars are cute. They're very wiggles. I know you have a caliper. You are very proud that you just bought that. Staff and one heart. Up oh, there's the heart. It's done in bullet holes. How romantic. 
All right, where's this stupid staff? Oh, right, I remember. What was that? 15, 20 minutes ago, tops? <laughs> I already forgot it. Right, okay. I know, we just did it. We literally just did it. You forgot too. Okay, I feel better. <laughs> oh my gosh. Short-term memory is something that ADH people have trouble with, too, if you didn't know that. I can't imagine you would have guessed. <laughs> All right, where's that lizard? Lizard, 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 bananas. Snakes are not lizards. Yes! Oh, absolutely. There's a lizard. It hurts. I know. It hurts us more than it hurts you, if you could imagine that. All right, one spade. Oh, maybe they made a digging spade. Let me look for a digging spade and a regular spade. Mm-hmm. I was right. All right, so what do we have over here? A comb. I do not see a comb. Oh, there it is. <laughs> yes, I agree. This game has been doing the... Oh, okay. You, you guys have fun while I do this. I really just like that the things are almost the same, but not. That screws with my brain. Let's see how many times I can click on the same thing, shall we? Alright, I'd start over. I've lost my train of place. Close. I think I've done that two times already. Oh my gosh! Thank you. Stupendous investigating Agent Fate. Alas, Vinny the Chin was nonchalantly perusing his favorite publication when the diamond was taken. GSQ. He is not the scumbag we are looking for. Click below. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. What are you guys going on about over here? Oh, hello, still mellow. Yes. How is reverse world? You solved a puzzle mansion in your dream? Nice. I have to find the portal in the attic and carry the villain monster killer through it. What are you guys talking about, Juggernaut? Actually, let me just do this. You, you guys have fun. Juggernaut, but what, like, all I know Juggernaut is, like, as a term and as the big red dude in X-Men. Oh, okay. Say no more. Those were insane. Okay, level 15. Ricardo Gherkin, a.k.a. Dick Pickle? Wow. Fruit vendor and toenail enthusiast. This is going in a weird direction, everyone. Prior arrests served time in Huntsville for smuggling Cuban cigars across the border inside hollowed out cucumbers. Suspect was paroled on good behavior after serving a dilly of a sentence that no one would relish. Suspect the in I'm sorry, inspect the produce stand where Mr. Gherkin works for clues to his whereabouts when the diamond was stolen. Be sure to also check any additional locales this shameful cretin might have might frequent. Keep your wits about you and good luck, Master Detective. I yeah. Could we just not? I mean, all we have to do is solve hidden puzzles, so I guess it's really not that bad, but yeah. Let's do this level first, because it was a pain last time. Alright. Plunger. Suitcase. I know I saw scissors in this level. Pretzel. Mug. Warrior statue. Which I also remember seeing. That's a goblin, not a warrior statue. Up oh, there he is. A brush and three anchors. Okay. So scissors, pretzel, mug. Scissors, pretzel, mug. And lizards. And more lizards. And more lizards. And a frog. And a pretzel. Scissors, mug. Yeah. Scissors, mug, brush. There's the mug. 
Where are the scissors? I remember finding scissors in here last time. Or the time for oh, there's the anchor. Scissors, scissors. Oh, there they are. I went right past them. Scissors, brush, on uh, two anchors. So brush and two anchors. Well, we found the one big obvious anchor. The other one, ah, is probably blended in somewhere. A brush and an anchor. I don't remember seeing a brush at all. Yeah, I know. It's really dark. Oh, wait. Is that an anchor? No. That's a harpoon gun. The brush is above the boards painted red. Oh, you're right. Thank you. I was not looking there. Next level. Oh, oh gosh darn it. Ugh. Gas station. Pistol. Computer desk. I'm sorry, computer disc, not computer desk. Electric guitar. Danish roll. Ooh, Danish. Starfish. Chili pepper, honey dipper, and tomato or tomato. All right, pistol computer desk. Oh, cool. I'll find that next time then. Thank you. Pistol computer disc, electric guitar. Why do I keep wanting to say computer desk? Pistol. Oh, this is Danish. Looks like it has raisins in it. There's a gorilla. Pistol computer disc, electric guitar. Pistol. There's a tomato. And the honey dipper. I remember finding the pistol every level, every time we do this level. There it is, and I never remember where it is. Computer disc and chili pepper. And it's not a computer disc. I think it's a CD. Which, I mean, is a disc that goes in a computer, but... Yep, there it is. It's not what that means. Do I see the chili pepper before we go? Nope, okay. Alright. Rocco's news. Oh, we have to look for a battery too. Oh, and there it is. Let's see. A chimpanzee, croquet mallet, bat, up there, turtle, ladybug, lizard, horseshoe, and an umbrella, which is right there. A chimpanzee, croquet mallet, and tort. A turtle. Yeah, a turtle. That's it. A turtle and a lizard, which is over here. Actually, I think that's a newt. Chimpanzee, croquet mallet, turtle. A turtle. There's a sea turtle. I can talk. I speak English most of the time. I mean, I don't have a choice in the matter. I don't know any other languages. But if I did, I'd probably speak them instead because English is annoying. Madam... What's that, Madam Ball Reader? Ruler, two shrunken heads. There's one. Scallop shell, which is there. <laughs> Esperanto. Garlic clove. Red pencil. Is that the red pencil? No. Uh, violin and two combs. Okay, there's one comb. A ruler, shrunken head, and a ball of yarn. Okay, ruler, there's a comb. Ruler, shrunken head, ball of yarn. Do I need lizards? No. Ruler, shrunken head. There's the ball of yarn. It's a pretty color. Shrunken head. You'd think the shrunken head would be easy to find. It is. It's right in the table in the middle of the screen. Ruler, garlic, red pencil, violin. There's the violin. And the red pencil's got to be in the only red spot. Well, I guess there's a couple. A ruler and a garlic clove. I just forgot all how this game worked momentarily. There's the ruler. No, stop it. Thank you. Do I see the garlic anywhere? Nope. Produce stand. Four army men. Artichoke. Button, stapler, two snakes, there's one, old football helmet, coin purse, and a lantern. This is a pretty lantern. Very uh, Middle Eastern style, like kind of Moroccan look to it. Okay, let's find the four army men. There's a cowboy. I don't know what that's supposed to be. 
There's one. Wow, he was hard to see. If I wasn't looking for him, I wouldn't have known what that was. Coin purse, bottom left. Oh, yeah. Next to the spider. That spider would be able to keep that, because there's no way I would be going after it if he was right there. A button and a snake. There's a snake. Where's the button? Button, button. Who's got the button? There it is. The door had the button. Oh, you know what? Before I forget, let me go back and get the anchor. Nope. You were wrong. It looks like an anchor, but it's not. Budge. Abe's Red Hots. Two rats. There's one. A donut. Oh, I haven't had donuts in not that long. But I really- that's not a donut, it's a bagel. Or maybe it's a glazed donut. Glazed donuts have to be exactly, like, perfect to be good. I mean, they're not bad if they're not, but like, if you get a good glazed donut, it's almost better than any other kind of donut. Krispy Kreme would be a good example, yes. There are no Krispy Kremes near here. The closest Krispy Kreme to us that I know of is the one in New York Penn Station. And they don't have fresh Krispy Kremes. They only have, like, I mean, they're not old, but they're not, like, hot out of the oven because they don't make them there. They ship them in. I saw the comb and they didn't click on it. There it is. And since Erdite doesn't go to New York for work at the moment because of all of the, you know, terribleness in the universe, we, we don't get to have Krispy Kreme donuts. Roller skates, cannon, magnifying glass, two keys, three skulls, of which that is one, iron hanger gavel. Okay. Roller skates, cannon, and a magnifying glass. Roller skates. Wait, I know where the cannon is. And a magnifying glass. There are roller skates down here. Nope, I was making that up. Okay. Roller skates, two keys, two skulls. Roller skates, two keys, two skulls. Oh, that's the hanger. Roller skates, two keys, two skulls. We can't order out for food right now because our road hasn't been plowed yet. Which kind of sucks because I want donuts. And we can't go anywhere because we're under quarantine. So, yay. Duckies! What do I need? Roller skates, one key, two skulls, iron, and a gavel. Hmm. There's a skull. That is a weird looking skull. It doesn't have any nose holes. Oh, those are the roller skates. I don't know why I was thinking they weren't down there. Is that the gavel? Wow, that's tiny. One skull, one key, and an iron. One skull, one key, and an iron. There's a key. So, a skull and an iron. Surprised I didn't see a skull. I did see the iron. Sheesh. Where's that skull? Like, way down here? Where was that one there? It was a weird noise the game just made. Ah, oh, there it is. A rip-off copy of the Necronomicon. All right, garlic clove. That is a fortune cookie, not a garlic. That looks like an upside down garlic. That birdie's stealing a marble. Marbles aren't for birdies. Up oh, there it is. Oh man, Erdite, are you still there? We are looking for 10 parts of a car. <sighs> a zoot? A lee? A heel? A heel? Is a heel a thing? Rude? A door! An axle. Axle. Bottom right going up. If you want, you can put where it is and what it is in the same sentence. I am perfectly okay with that. Wheel. Where's double E's? There's two Z's. A zoot, yeah. There's two E's. Where are they? Far left going down. Oh, I had that. I had it heel. But it was wheel. Door, wheel, um, trunk, maybe? Trunk? See, look at this one. There's two different kinds of T's. 
Ugh. That makes my poor little brain angry. A glogomal? Oh, I forgot what I was looking for. An engine? An engine would be a thing. Engine! Ha 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 ha! I found one! Windshield! I just saw it as soon as you said it. Maybe I just need to know what the words are. A llama. Um, what do we got? Maybe like a trunk or a boot? Probably. There's a zoot. Which, hot punk. Yeah, well that's, it makes it even harder. Yeah, sometimes it's trunk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Trunk. I was looking for, oh, there it is. Thank you. Wipers. I'm just impressed how you are finding these. That one I don't see. Second row, middle. Second row, middle. Oh, going this way. Sorry. No, let go. Thank you. Hood. Is this? Nope. Where do you see hood? Oh. I was right there. How did I miss that one? Yeah, I got it. Mirror. Next to hood. Oh. Hey, stop that. Thank you. We just need one more. Suit is gone. <laughs> Lights! Oh. Light? L I G O. Headlights. Stop that! Thank you. Innocent! Fantastic detective work, Agent Fate. You have proven that Mr. Gherkin is not involved in the theft of the diamond. Okay. Where he was going coconut bowling is another mystery altogether. That sounds messy. Click blow. All right, we are at an hour and a half. How many more of these guys do we have? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, I think we are gonna cut it here. And the next time we play, we will finish the game. Ooh, the next level's only got 27 minutes. I haven't been keeping track. Like, how long did it take me to do these? Oh, wait, I'm up here. Does it say, like, what I finished them at? No, it just says my total te time elapsed. Okay, that's fine. All right, so let me back out. And quit. Oh, there we go. I can push my screen back. Oh, boy. Oh, that's better. I know, right? <laughs> I really hope Ravenhurst has a bigger size screen than this one. It's got to, right? Right? Uh, at any rate, that was fun. Next time, we're going to do Mystery Trackers. And I don't know where we left on, uh, left off on that, but that's what we're doing next time. And what else is going on? I think that's it. I don't know. I, I, my, my eyes are also tired now and Ravenhurst. I'm using Big Fish. We own most of them on Big Fish because I've been playing these games far too long. I'm pretty sure I started in 2007 or 2009. No, actually, I'm pretty sure it was 2009. And I have so many games I've bought over the years. Ancient history is right. You are not kidding. Ha ha ha. You're old too. Poopy head. <laughs> Make sure you check the description for all of the weirdness that we went through today that I can't remember any of. Yeah, well. <laughs> there we go. And I guess I'm supposed to say, like, follow me on social media. I guess you can do that. I have them. There they are. I'm not much good at like promoting this, so I guess like button, subscribe, click the bell, comment. It's so dumb. It's like obviously you know to do that. I assume you've been on YouTube as long as I have as a consumer of YouTube. So yeah, maybe like I'm subscribe. <laughs> Slam that bell. <laughs> I mean, I know that's actually what you're supposed to do to, like, increase your viewership and all that, but I don't know. I forget, first of all. I get to this point and I'm like, what am I supposed to be doing? I don't remember. Consume Home Bay. <laughs> I could put subliminal messages at the end. There you go. That might work better. Then I wouldn't have to remember. I could put a little thing over here that says, like, comment, and subscribe in the bottom corner. 
I don't know why I would do that, though. I'm pretty sure you know that already. And if you can't figure out to follow me on social media with my social media things literally in front of you, then I'm probably saying it is not going to help. <laughs> All right. I think I shall be done now. So I am Faith Touched and I will see you later. Bye.